as we now look forward to the first individual final of the evening in the triple jump. So, Matthias Saar of Brazil lining up for his third jump in this men's triple jump final. He uh, has the best so far of 15.48 on his first attempt. Had a no jump on his second round and needs at least 15.73 to get into the top eight, which is where they make the cut. So he's on the board. Oh, and that's a good jump from the Brazilian. So that'll be moving in, him into the top eight. He's got a best of 16 meters, 14. 16, 21. So that puts him in silver medal position at the moment. The defending champion from 2017. He's jumped 17 meters 18. That's his personal best from 2017. He jumped 20, 17, 29 indoors. He is the defending champion, but he's had two no jumps. So this is it. He could be out if he has a no jump on this attempt. Well, he's on the board. Oh, and he sails past that red line that we can see on the graphic in the pit. And that is the leading jump so far. So two nose rows, you can see there, goes straight into the lead, 16.58. And we're coming into the last jump. So Milo of Brazil on the runway, on the runway for his sixth and final attempt in the order that it is. He's reversed after the fifth round. Oh, he looks fast. There's a bow because he knows he's had a reasonable jump there. You know when you've had a reasonable contact with the floor. Look, look at this. Skips, jumps into the pit. 16.57. It's currently led by Babayev of Azerbaijan, the defending champion at 16.58. So he misses by one centimetre. So now we go to Matias Sa of Brazil. 16.36, currently fourth. Two centers, two centimeters behind the Turk Ozupek, who's on 1638, but follows this jump. So, what can the Brazilian do? Can he get into the medals? He needs 1638 at least. Sixth and final attempt for the Brazilian. So, he's on the board. Oh! And if the red line indicates, then he has improved. We have to wait because it's close. Let's have a look at this. Great pace on the run-up. Good kneeling. He's like a, a skimming stone, isn't he? He hits that half, he stays up, keeps the hips high. Great jump into the pit. 16.57, he matches his compatriot Melo and goes into the silver medal position on countback. Elzipak, the Turk, has one jump. He's been pushed out of the medals. 16.38, he needs 16.57 and more now to get into the medals. So final jump for Can Ozipak. Can Ozipak get in the medals? Oh, he has, I think, he has. He has. Has he got the white flag? Yes, he has. So, Milo, who went from sixth to second, has gone to third on countback. And Osupak, the Turk, has come out and he may have gone into the lead with that jump. 16.56, oh my word. So, we have gold going to Babiev. The defending champion wins by one centimeter to Matias Sar of Brazil, 16.57. His compatriot, Alexandro Milo of Brazil, 16.57, but on countback takes the bronze. And Ozopak, who jumps 16.56 and finishes in four. What a conclusion to this event. And Babiev now can relax. He's got the gold by a centimeter. 
and he's a 17 meter man so let's hope that he wants to get over 17 meters because that would be the icing on the cake for this competition here he goes final attempt he's on the board and he's gone large yeah he's gone large at last babiev from Azerbaijan, who won it in 2017, takes it again. We knew that before the last attempt. We're waiting for that distance to come up. But that's how you do it. 16.89, so it's just short of 17 metres. And there we have confirmation of the men's triple jump. Babiev takes his second goal. Saar, Brazil, 16.57 silver. He beat uh, Milo on countback for the silver medal, and Milo takes the bronze.